Macca's guides. <laughs> Hey guys, Mac here, Metro 2033 Redux. This is the Manhattan Project Achievement slash Trophy. Radiation hotspots are typically located on the surface. The first time you'll come across one that is easy to find is on Dead City. And for this achievement, you have to spend 60 seconds inside of a radiation spot. Now what you're gonna need is obviously a gas mask, lots of filters, and five med kits. If you walk into this building and go into this room, there is a safe key on that soldier or on that fallen enemy. Uh, but this is also a radiation hotspot. Now, how do you know it's a radiation hotspot? Well, first of all, when you do jump into it, your watch will beep multiple times and you will begin taking damage even if you're not being attacked by anything or you're not moving. So that's why you see my um, screen flashing red. What I recommend is just staying put in the middle of the room and letting your screen blink red until it becomes a deep red as you can see on screen right now. At that point, use one of your med kits. Also, make sure you're constantly refilling your filter. I don't know if this helps for certain, but I noticed that when I did refill my filter, my screen did seem to blink a little less. Now, you can space out your med kits about 15 uh, seconds apart, so you should be able to do this with three or four med kits. I'm gonna stay in here for as long as I possibly can just to uh, uh, do proof of concept here. But I'm at 55 seconds already. The achievement would basically be unlocking, and I still have two more med kits. My screen's deep red, so I'm going to use one again. And this is the easiest place to get this. Uh, as I said, most of the radiation hotspots are above ground. I think the ones underground are only located in Metro Last Light. Um, so just make sure you scrounge around for more med kits if you need them. I'll also be quickly showing you two more radiation uh, areas in this mission that you can use if for whatever reason this one's causing you trouble or you end up further on in the mission before you notice that you need this achievement. A little bit later on in the mission you'll cross this park and on the opposite side of the park there's an enemy which I've taken out. If you look at this car right here, if you actually go up right directly behind it, you'll actually hear your watch going off and you'll start taking damage. Um, so that's your another radiation hotspot. There's like five at least in this map. And then another one, on your way to the very end of the level, that's where I'm kind of going right now towards the exit of the level, um, you'll notice that there is this kind of uh, little alcove up there. So I'm pointing to where you need to go. But if you go down here and then climb up this beam, uh, turn around once at the top of the beam and jump onto that second story, you will find a small room with a soldier in the middle. And this is also a radiation hotspot. You're free to use any of those for the achievement. And it should be pretty easy, should be pretty straightforward for you guys. Thanks for watching. Make sure you comment, like, and subscribe. Hopefully, I see you in my next video. Peace.